Okay, so Google Maps now has the coolest feature where you can share your live trip with someone. And uh, it's absolutely fantastic. With one major drawback, and I'm going to show that drawback and how you can get around it. So, uh, right now I'm currently on a trip to go home. And say I want to share this with someone. The way you share it is you click on where uh, the remaining miles are. And you can see the share trip progress. So you click on that. And then it's got the last few that you've used or more. And you want to go to more. And at this point, it will um, have your contacts and you can do a search here. And in this example, I want to use my father as I'm going to be sending it to him. So I, I see three results here, and this is from my contacts. So I've got his mobile number, which I'm going to select. And then at the bottom here, you click share. And then it says that he can see my route. So you would assume at this point that it sent him a text message and that he clicked on a link in the text message and now he can see my route but that's not exactly what's happening and to tell you the truth I'm not sure what's happening but I can do any of those and it will not come through as a text message that he can get into so if you click on it again uh, you can do stop sharing so now I've stopped sharing, and even though he didn't see anything on his side, um, it should have been sent to him, but there's a problem with the functionality there. So I'll show you how to get around that. What you do is you do the same thing, and you do share trip in progress, and uh, just put in a bogus number here. share via a link so the first time I shared it with him like I said it, it didn't send anything from my phone that I could visibly see I would expect to see like a sent text message and there's no such thing uh, on his side I'm not sure exactly what happened but now um, this time it's going to actually when I click share if I minimize everything, so it says the 1111 can see my location. So if I minimize everything now and I go into my text messages, um, there we go. Now it says, see me on Google Map, the link that anyone can see. There's not any um, security associated with this, so you could send this to. 100 people and they can all see it. So at this point, what I want to do is copy this. Uh, you just came through on my computer. Oops, just lost you. Well, we've tried this over and over again. He hasn't been able to see it. So what I'm going to do is send him a new one, the one that I, with the multiple ones on there. And this one he'll be able to be able to get into the other ones no luck and we've tried it with uh, with his name as I search I'll go back to that I'll show you the which ones we've tried oops so if I'm gonna share I'm gonna click stop sharing which is probably gonna confuse him right now I'm gonna go back in and share again I do my search here so you can see that there's three ways his name shows up and this is pulling all from the same contact uh, Ron E. Krieger, Daddy e. Krieger and Hotmail and then the Gmail and then the phone number we've tried all three of those none of those work the only way to successfully get it to work is send it to that bogus phone number and then copy it and paste it